Jersey Sports Zone's boys basketball coverage is being brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. The Boardwalk Basketball Classic continues in Wildwood. Bishop Eustis taking on Pemberton in the Bill Osborne Bracket Championship game. Both teams enter this one undefeated. First quarter, Tom Semiralio finds Joey Callahan on the inbounds play. Callahan buries the three, and Eustis leads 8-2. Later in the first, it's Semiralio from downtown. Tom Semiralio hits the three, and the Crusaders lead 14-5 after one. Second quarter, the Hornets trying to cut into the deficit. Adrian Lemons with the steal. Lemons finishes with the layup for Pemberton. Later in the second, Dakari Harrell with the ball for the Hornets. Dishes to Keon Dennis. Dennis hits the floater in the lane. Pemberton within six. Under a minute to go in the half now. Callahan, great look down low to Semiralio for the bucket. The Crusaders lead it 24 to 16 at halftime. Third quarter, Eustace in transition. Callahan to James Ionelli on the run. Ionelli finishes with the layup and the Crusaders lead is still eight. Lemons keeping Pemberton in the game. He hits back-to-back -back threes before Harrell finds him on the break for the layup. Adrian Lemons a team high 15 points and the Hornets are within three. But Eustace responds. Semiralio drives to the hoop, gets it to go and one. The sophomore putting a big game together for the Crusaders. Then later in the third, it's Semiralio again. Tom Semiralio into the lane once more, finishes plus the foul again. A game high 26 points for Tom Semiralio. Eustace pushes it to a 10 point lead after three. The Crusaders create even more separation early in the fourth. Ionelli cutting to the hoop. James Ionelli finishes off the glass to extend the lead to 14. The senior scored 19 points against St. Joseph Academy on Tuesday. He goes for 19 more in this one. Semiralio finds Ionelli on the backdoor cut as Eustace cruises in the fourth quarter. 63 to 44 the final. The Crusaders win the Bill Osborne Bracket Championship and are taking the trophy back to Pensauken. Feels great. Uh, we came here, we got two wins in a row. Uh, we thought it'd be tougher the first two rounds, but we got it done. Bishop Eustis is now 5-0 on the season. Pemberton falls to 6-1. At the Wildwoods Convention Center, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.